Brawlers, it's 2020 now, so Bakugan Battle Planet has evolved into Bakugan Armored Alliance. I'm still regular old Ventus Knight, but my Bakugan here are cooler and more detailed than ever before, and the brand new Bakugear toys can be used to upgrade your Bakugan into even stronger ones. Today we're unboxing the brand new Armored Alliance versions of the Awesome Brawlers Partner Bakugan. Well, he's not an official team member, but Nilius and his partner Magnus did help them save the day in Bakugan Battle Planet, so we'll let him in on a technicality here. These six are the first taste you'll get of Baku gear, so if you see one of these in stores soon, you'll find them all if you keep hunting. Naturally, the first we gotta check out here is Dragonoid Ultra. Dan's classic partner is back in a new Ultra form that works beautifully with his Flame Cannon Baku gear. Drago! Yeah! B power and a 200 B power Baku gear makes him a total beast with 1,100 B power in total. I think this will work, Dan. Okay. Element cannon. And he certainly looks the part too when you spread out his arms and wings fan out those feet, and pop in the Pagan Baku gear attachments for the Flame Cannon. If you position everything just right, man, he looks awesome! By the way, the Pagan Baku gear are additional parts of the main transforming Baku gear that can even be attached to Armored Alliance Bakugan Core. If you've been keeping up with the Bakugan show on Netflix and Cartoon Network, you'll know that being stuck on the ground has landed Hydrus in some serious trouble before. That's not an issue anymore with Hydrus Ultra's Baku gear. Wings of Aquos. Hydras can now take to the skies and battle next to Drago and Pegatrix with some boosted strength, too. These Pagan Baku Gear claws aren't messing around, and the Wings of Aquos themselves can even fire missiles! The orange paint on his fangs makes him extra scary, especially when you complete his look by unfolding Hydras' hind legs so he can go on the offensive. The new Trox Ultra is still stuck on the ground, but his Ventus Cyclinator Baku Gear can whip up a storm and blast his launched opponents to bits with the Baku Mortar Pagan Baku Gear pieces. I'm a huge fan of the new sculpted heads for Armored Alliance Bakugan like Trox Ultra and Howlcore Ultra. They have a very retro Battle Brawlers like feeling to them, don't they? Of course, the increase in detail in Armored Alliance's Bakugan is immediately evident, especially if you make sure to fold out Trox Ultra's manual arms and feet. Trox Ultra's jaw even opens and closes! Speaking of retro touches, did you notice the stamped faction symbols on every Armored Alliance Bakugan? So even if you happen to customize your Bakugan in some way, as long as you don't touch that faction symbol, it'll always be obvious which faction they are. He doesn't come with Baku gear, but while you're out on your Baku hunts, keep your eyes peeled for Diamond Trox Ultra. Only the luckiest brawlers may stumble upon this elusive Bakugan, so bring him home if you manage to find him. He's the first Diamond Bakugan Ultra to release this year, but he certainly won't be the last. I teased you with the Halicore Ultra mention earlier, so he's just gotta be next, right? Check out those beautiful heads! They look so perfect now! And don't worry, Brawlers, the Armored Alliance Halicore Ultra only requires two hands to close. This pup only has four paws, though, so it's a good thing his Mecha Claws Baku Gear provides a couple of helping hands. They'll slash opponents to pieces when coupled with the Pagan Baku Gear Dark Daggers. But don't forget to unleash Howlcore's full par by flipping out his manual front paws before the action happens. Darkest reigns supreme in this first wave of Bakugan Ultra with Baku Gear as Nilius doubles down on the darkness. His scorching swords phenomenally highlight the brand new translucent colored plastic we're using for the Baku Gear toys to give them an extra special touch. Just look at that purple fire! If you position it just right, you can get some pretty cool shots of the flames illuminating Nilius' heads. Nilius can even prepare for hand-to-hand -hand combat with those Pegon Baku gear of his, which are sure to complete the package here. But if you're going for an intimidating photo op, don't forget to spread his massive wings for plus two intimidation. Pegatrix Ultra is our final Bakugan Ultra with Baku gear, kicking off Armored Alliance, and she's a fantastic one to wrap up a batch. Unlike Battle Planets, Armored Alliance's new Pegatrix Ultra stands on all four legs. 
make sure to unfold all four of her manual legs, or else she'll be a bit stubby. Bakugan can only grow to full power with the help of their brawlers, so throw Peggy a bone here and spread her wings and horn out too to complete her majestic silhouette. Then power her up with the Hale's Lightning Striker and peg on Hale Bracer's Baku gear so she can majestically fry her enemies. Two transformations and four toys in one Bakugan. How do you like the brand new Bakugan Ultra with Baku gear? These guys are brand new additions to the world of Bakugan, so you'll be seeing them in stores soon on their very own shelf peg next to the Bakugan Core and Bakugan Ultra packs. Many brawlers have already reported finding Armored Alliance Bakugan at their local retailers, so keep checking in person and online until you can find them too. Until next time, good luck gearing up for your next Bakugan Brawl!